Hey guys, it's been a while since the last update. I kind of stopped um, documenting the process once the wall started going up because it's just been a huge learning curve and a lot of work and documenting things as I was going just wasn't in the cards. But I wanted to share an update with you all, show you the progress we've made. Um, huge thanks to my friend Jeff who has been by my side for this whole process. Um, couldn't have done it without him, but I was up taking the dock out today and thought I'd um, take the camera up and give you guys an update. So here is where we're at. So we got the roof on. I basically just hooked sheathing up to Jeff and his, his friend came up too to help with that part. Um, then we have to get the uh, ice and water shield up on the roof and then finish sheathing it and wrap it and wait for the windows really. So we're sitting, sitting pretty good. Uh, here's where you'll, you'll enter. <clears throat> and these really pretty beams. And then these are going to be posts that are going to support um, this corner and then this corner of the loft. And then I'm, I'm going to build an extension of the loft that just goes along this back wall. And we're going to build the, the kids' bunk beds up in that area. We'll have a, a big tall railing too. Yeah, it's coming together. It's fun to see a roof on too, it kind of gives you a sense of scale. And there's the big windows. The view is really pretty from the loft, you can see the lake. And the wood stove will go right here. And go all the way up through the roof. Get a nice long draw. Oh. Take you up to the loft as well here. So there we are. So basically from about four and a half feet out from this wall, the loft will continue that way. And then the kids' bunks will be there and They'll be able to climb in kind of from the foot of their beds and there'll be either a partition wall with some little lookout windows or just a, like a good railing, a tightly spaced railing. Get you all the way up here. So we have to cut that piece of sheathing out eventually, but you can see, get a sense for the views from up here. And the stairs will come up from, the stairs will start right when you walk in the door and go up to a landing and two more steps, and then you'll be in the loft. And so we'll probably put a bed right here Kind of the head of the bed by this window. And then this is where we'll continue for the kids' little sleeping area. I was thinking it would be really cool too to put a skylight in here someday. You could sleep and look at the stars. All sorts of ideas. This window, that window. But yeah, that's the progress. It's uh, it's been stressful, but a lot of fun. So hope you enjoy uh, following along. <laughs> 